the 2025 Paris Air Show. We are now on the large display of uh, Airbus. But uh, I am meeting with the head of unmanned systems at Airbus Helicopter, Victor Gerard-Rose, for a brief update on uh, the latest with their well, unmanned systems at Airbus Helicopters, uh, namely the Flex Rotor and the VSR 700. Victor, good morning. Thank you for welcoming us. Good morning. Thank you. So we are standing next to this uh, Flex Rotor VTOL uh, UAV. Uh, you recently conducted some uh, experiments with the, the French Navy. That's the main reason I wanted to talk to you. But uh, first, for the audience watching us that may not be familiar with the system, can you please briefly introduce the Flex Rotor to us? Yes. Um, so yes, the Flex Rotor is our newest uh, uh, product uh, in our US uh, portfolio within Airbus Helicopter. Uh, it's a drone which is able to take off vertically and then uh, fly uh, like a fixed wing aircraft, uh, so really cruising. Uh, this capability to take off vertically and then cruise offers him uh, some unrivaled performances. So it's, uh, it's able to cruise during 20 to, 20 to 14 hours uh, with up to uh, eight kilograms of, uh, of payloads. And it's then perfectly adapted for any reconnaissance or intelligence uh, missions. These are, uh, yes, very uh, interesting uh, performance figures. Uh, is it battery operated or does it use free fuel? Uh, it's it's using, uh, using fuel. Um, so it's, uh, yes, it's a fuel engine. We have on top a heavy fuel engine uh, capability which allows him to uh, operate on, uh, on ships. Uh, so as I mentioned, you recently conducted a test with the French Navy aboard one of their uh, OPV, uh, Aviso type. Uh, can you tell us more about this experimentation? Yes, so we had the opportunity to, to fly uh, during the frame of the Perseus uh, exercise. Uh, we, we have flown uh, um, during uh, more than 12 hours, day and night uh, missions, conducting some uh, intelligence and surveillance reconnaissance uh, missions uh, together with, uh, with the French forces. In terms of uh, existing operators, uh, can you name uh, any? Uh, is there any uh, current users? Yes, so it's, it's already uh, in operation uh, for, the, for the US Navy. So we are already operating since several years for, for the US Navy. Uh, it's as well used for firefighting missions um, to, to do some reconnaissance on, uh, on the fire area. Uh, so yes, it's already in operation and in service. Yeah. All right, Victor. Uh, so this was a very interesting, very uh, unique system, and like uh, well, uh, not many others. Uh, I see the larger VSR 700 uh, behind you. May we go closer yes. and take a closer look? Victor, the VSR 700 is uh, being considered by the French Navy for the SDAM uh, program, so rotary uh, wing uh, UAV to go on uh, frigates. What is the latest uh, status of the program? Yes, so we are we are very proud to have signed yesterday the framework agreement with the French Minister of Armed Forces for the VSR 700. So it's a, a major milestone for for the program, which has been passed yesterday in presence of the Minister of the Armed Forces. So that means uh, it has been selected now. Yes, the VSR 700 uh, has been selected uh, by by France. So major milestone indeed. Uh, you're showcasing it for the first time uh, with uh, new capabilities, uh, namely uh, guided rockets. Yes, so it, it, uh, we are working on incrementally developing uh, new missions for the VSR 700. Uh, you see here, so we showcase uh, the Armed Scout version equipped with rocket. Uh, we have as well um, a, a version which is equipped with for anti-submarine uh, warfare uh, missions. So you see with with Sunboy, uh, with with MAD, with depth charges. So uh, we have the combination of the different system uh, which can be installed on the on the VSR 700 for this anti-submarine warfare uh, mission. And we are as well working on some other missions like for. For instance, uh, cargo missions uh, where the VSR can be used uh, to transport uh, some, uh, some payloads attached to it. All right, Victor, and uh, lastly, uh, what is next for Airbus helicopters in this program? So on the VSR 700 program now, the objective is to, uh, to deliver, uh, to start the, the operations. Um, and then we are as well working on the teaming um, between 
our drones, so the Flex Rotor and the VSR 700, but even other drones with helicopters uh, using uh, a tablet that we have uh, as well um, presented during this show, uh, which is, let's say, allowing to perform uh, crude and crude uh, teaming uh, between uh, an unmanned platform and uh, a manned platform with a really easy to, to integrate tablet, modem and uh, four antennas attached to the, to the helicopter and which is the launch of the H-teaming uh, product line that we have introduced during this show. So potentially a future uh, French Navy uh, HIL or Gepard helicopter crew members will be able to control their VSR 700 with this solution should they select it? Yes, yes, exactly. Very well, Victor, thank you very much. Thank you.